what up what up guys it's your boy just king za and uh yeah man as you can see uh by the title of this video we must not allow the da to take power in south africa we cannot allow that um basically uh we are being divided and and um the only thing left is to conquer us you know what i'm saying the dividing part is it's it's happening how many uh people have left the nc and started their own parties <clears throat> how many new voices that were not necessary that don't did not have to come out of the nc have we had you know there's so many and um this division has been happening for a long time they've been dividing the nc bit by bit bit by bit and now officially they got to the big fish which is zuma they got to the big fish jacob zuma and look at how much of a chunk he took out he took out 14 percent you know what i'm saying he took out 14 percent and um the anc has been put down to 40 percent this is all this is all division <clears throat> we as black people have to i get it uh, we, we the anc got too comfortable and uh we're fighting of course we're fighting but may this not be the end of the fight may, may this not be the final straw or the final uh decision you know we need to come back together all these parties need to come back together the anc needs to humble itself and uh, proper discussions must be had and black people black parties need to come back together they need to come back together they need to reconcile we need to reconcile quickly within these five years we need to recon uh, reconcile and we need to be a strong thing a strong unit that has agreed and will not disagree for <clears throat> the next 50 years if we still want to have rulership of south africa we cannot allow a european race you know to run south africa that cannot happen sorry to say this but i agree with Af Af our african brothers i've been disagreeing with them a lot but they i agree with them here it cannot happen person of the black skin must run south africa must be the government you know we cannot have a situation where we are being run by the children of our oppressors you know i get it they have changed they've done this thing and they've tried to heal themselves and they try to see black people but um it's it's a fact that there's still so many races if if i can really calculate for you in my mind only one percent of the white race is not racist only one percent if one percent of a population can be uh, the successful ones the rich ones and whatever you can also use the same analogy when it comes to whites for you to really find non-racist whites like someone who is completely evolved that's probably one percent of that population you know what i'm saying so we cannot vote them um yes um people have voted for them of course but we must not be sidetracked their voting did not grow it remained the same it remained the same so let's not think that people voted da no is the same people the white colored indian you know what i'm saying it's around the same numbers but when you look at the anc you can see because last time they got 10 million votes and now they got 6 million votes if you can calculate you can see you know that 2 million 2.5 million or somewhere went to the mk if that 2. Point what what million was back but we didn't go to the mk or the mk was never formed the ANC would have six, seven, eight, about nine million, close to nine million votes, which would be around about similar to what they got last time. And then maybe if the other, you know what I'm saying, so uh, the MK is the reason why um, a lot of votes, voters, you know, shifted from the ANC. Let's not think like, you no, know, the ANC has fallen or whatever. Yes, it has, but by... Uh, Jacob Zuma and that can be fixed you know that can be fixed that can still be fixed you know what I'm saying 
that can still be fixed that can still be arranged properly and uh, uh, an agreement can be can be had by the two parties and uh, we just need to hear each other out we just need to people need to stop doing corruption people need to hear people out people need to fix roads people need to to really do good by their communities people need to make sure that people have water people need to make sure that corruption goes down and we need to stop playing with our resources but all of that what is worse is an apartheid government I know people said I can't believe he said what he said because that thing is really not building us uh, people are really believing those things that apartheid was better apartheid was never better you know so we can never ever allow we, can, we can't go back we can't go back in time we can't so that you can get a job and get paid five cent. No, guys. Let's let's let's. They, 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 they are playing a game and they are dividing us. They are dividing us until we are nothing. They're gonna make the ANC go below ten percent. They're gonna make the EFF go below ten. Uh, remain where it is. They're gonna make the the MK and then they are just gonna grow. They're gonna go from thirty percent to forty. They're gonna become the majority. You know. So we need to be careful. The only way is unity. We need to unite. We need to.